Is it on? Okay. Today our topic is the fly line, the type of fly line. Well, the fly line is the most important part in your fishing tool. There are many good brands and good fly lines in the market, but there are few simple things that you should know and understand choosing your fly line. We won't be discussing the shape of a fly line, the shape of its taper in this video, but for, for the beginning, we just divide it into separate parts just to understand basic shapes of the fly line. And first of all, there's a level fly line. Actually, it's only running that we use level these days. But long ago, there was a fly line that used to be level one. The whole line had exact the same thickness from one end to another. And it was labeled with the letter L. Then a double taper line. It's also level line, only with tapers in both ends. Then you can switch it to one side to another and it will work the same. Taper was founded and designed to make the presentation smoother. Then the most popular one, it's a weight forward line. It has a head and running line. The head has front taper and taper and different length in different models. Depending on those parts and the shape of it, it has a different character, but we will discuss it in the next video. This shape was designed to load the rod faster and to increase the shooting distance, especially in windy conditions. And the last one is a shooting head. The shooting head is a fly line for, created for shooting and it usually has a head with a very short rear taper and a separate running line. There are some lines with the running line as well but the main point of shooting head is not the running line that is separate or, or attached. The main point is that you are casting only the head and when you want to reach the distance, you shoot. Those heads are usually a bit heavier than a normal fly line because you're casting only the head and you make every single cast using the exact length of your line. Some say it's very effective and I cannot bet on it but it's easy to cast for sure. On the other hand, the control of long line, long distance and picking up the long line is very hard or nearly impossible. So that's it for today and thank you for asking questions and writing us. Next time we will talk more about weight forward lines and the shape of it. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe and see you in the next video.